right, welcome to Sunday. So today what I'm making um, is for a little Sunday treat. I think I tied my apron too tight, whatever. Okay, so we are going to be using our Rock Croc. This is the Rock Croc Everyday Pan. And I got this in my kit and I love it. Okay, so we are making cinnamon roll pull party thingies in it. Um, so what I've done is I've melted my butter, kind of. So I melted the butter. It's a half a cup of butter, so one stick. Sorry, my head might cut off sometimes. And then we put a half a cup of brown sugar. And we're just gonna stir that in with the butter. Lately, you guys, I don't know about your kids, but I am so ready for them to go back to school. It's been spring break this week, and oh my gosh. Yes, yes, they have been obnoxious. Okay, so I don't know if you can see that, but I've mixed in the brown sugar. I might have to stir it again real fast, but I'm going to set this off to the side. Oh, there goes my little thing. Good thing I've got a little paper towel. Uh, where to put it where to put it we'll just set it here on my paper towel out of the way okay so I've got some of them cut up but you just get two um, Pillsbury cinnamon roll canned cinnamon rolls and then I'm also gonna look how awesome this knife is you guys look I have a stack of cinnamon rolls and it's cutting it so slick I really have enjoyed almost everything I have gotten in my kit or purchased so but I love kind of doing these videos so I can show you guys how easy the things are to use it has saved me lots of time in my kitchen by having different things that just make it go by so faster okay so we're going to I just got to cut up this real fast so I'm going to pause it um, after I get this in the oven. So you preheat your oven to 375. And they're going to cook for 20 to 25 minutes. So what I'll probably do is pause the video and then come back, turn it back on, um, and show you the done product. Okay, so I've got them in a bag. And then it just says use cinnamon sugar. My, I have a daughter that loves cinnamon toast, so she already has some cinnamon sugar made up for me. Woo, so that's I'm just me. Throw it okay. in the. I don't really know. I can't remember what the recipe said, but you can't have too much cinnamon and sugar. I don't think. So you just kind of sprinkle the cinnamon and sugar on there. And the reason I'm making these is because my husband, um, we made carrot cake for Easter and I still have some cream cheese frosting I need to use. So, like, I don't know if you can see that, but I think it's covered pretty good in cinnamon and sugar. I'm just gonna hurry and stir up my brown sugar in here again and butter. So what's great about the Rock Croc is, um, this pan can literally go anywhere. It is, as they say, it's an everyday pan. There's several different Rock Rock pans that all do the same thing, but it's completely awesome. You can cook it in the oven, which we are gonna do here in a minute for our cinnamony things. You can use it on your stove top to brown hamburger or, you know, make, tacos or whatever and then you can do a quick throw it in the microwave when you don't have a lot of time like you work uh, you're a working mom and you come home you don't know what to make to, for dinner just make pasta or something in it uh, one thing we have done in it with the microwave is fajitas so we just throw the um, peppers and onions and meat we mix it with fajita mix and lime juice and all that stuff and throw it in the microwave it cooks in like 20 minutes so really awesome okay so here we've got those in the pan we're gonna throw them in the oven for 20-25 minutes 
and I will be back to show you the final product. Yum!